Hello and welcome to Thaik. I am Ahmad Adnan and in this video we are going to discuss about why do we need to learn SQL that is structured query language. It is a really important thing for the people who are taking the field in data analytics in their career. If you are new to this channel or if you haven't subscribed yet, just click on the subscribe button and also press the bell icon to get the latest notifications. Now let's get started. Just have a look at this one. This is MS SQL. And if you look at the query here, it is select top thousand. These are the things from this table, right? And have a look at this. This is from Google BigQuery. It selects from this table name, order by this, descending, and then the mid 20. Have a look at this. This is from Snowflake. It is, has, has a similar kind of select statement here. Now have a look at this one. This is MySQL. This is also similar kind of structure. And have a look at this. This is Oracle PL SQL. And this also has almost same functions here. And have a look at this. Postgres SQL. This is also similar kind of thing when compared to MS SQL. Now have a look at this as well, Amazon Treship. This is also a similar kind of thing. And this is the MongoDB. This is also from the table name, but its technology is not null. Now, these are the top databases I have taken here. MS SQL Server, Oracle PL, SQL, MySQL, Amazon Redshift, Google BigQuery, PostgreSQL, MongoDB, and the Snowflake. So these are the top databases which is already using many of the organizations throughout the world. So what I feel is, so learning a SQL server, being a data analyst is an important thing here. So I'm going to make a video on related to this topic in another video. So have a look at that to get a deep understanding of it, why you need to learn the SQL server. So why do we need to learn? It is used in almost all the top databases throughout the world. All of them has similar functions, but not completely same. Yes, most of the functions, it's already available in every databases, like the rank function you can see in on the Oracle is the same, which are using SQL Server and whatnot. Most of the grouping functions also the same in every databases. So if you have learned how to write the SQL queries, then you can handle any top databases. So mainly all the job related to data analytics requires to have a SQL language experience. Yeah, I have faced this. So most of the companies, if they are taking the people for the Power BI or any other BI tools, they require to have a SQL knowledge about it, how you can write the complex queries like functions, stored procedures, views in order to extract the data in a desired format. So you can check out the videos in future, nearly future, I'm going to publish those videos about the SQL, how we can learn the SQLs in my channel. So if you are in hurry, then you can check out many of the other channels in the YouTube as well. So I prefer you to learn the SQL as well, not only Power BI. So this is what I feel. So if you're moving your career into data analytics in 2021, or you are already in data analytics field, so it is a must for you to learn the SQL query. This is my point of view that you need to learn the SQL in order to grow in your career into the data analytics field. So if you have any other queries and feedback, just post it in the comment section below. If you are new to this channel or if you haven't subscribed yet, just click on the subscribe button and also press the bell icon to get the latest notifications. If you are not a member of our channel, just hit the join button to know in detail about it. Share it with your friends and colleagues. Thanks for watching. Keep learning. See you in my next video.